guys, Robby46 here, welcome yourselves back to MXGP3. We are racing at Italy in career mode. Uh, we haven't done MXGP3 video for a little while, so um, that's why we're doing one now. So apologies to the people that enjoy MXGP videos, but we're back. Here we go. Trying to uh, get back into the lead. We start on pole, but we've gone wide. Not that pole position actually makes a difference because you're all starting their line anyway. Second place at the moment in quite a dark and dingy Italy at the moment. Very dusty. Second are uh, championship rivals in first at the moment. So that's our target to beat him. That's what we're going to try and do. It's been quite a while since I played MXGP3 as well. So hopefully we can get back into the swing of things. Almost over him then, but not quite. Like I said in the previous video, if you can remember back that long, um, I have knocked the laps down to three. That way we can get more racing in as we go into the lead. No, we don't. He's come back through. All right, so we've got a bit of work to do still. So yeah, just three laps per race now. That way we can get more uh, races and actual videos. Come on. Yeah, he's holding his own at the moment. And don't worry, there are more MotoGP 70 videos coming, so don't you worry about that. Oh, we got a good run there. We're back into the lead. Is he going to come back through? Try not to let him. Oh, we're going a bit wide though, drifting a little bit wide. Still hear him right behind me. Oh, fuck. What's going on here? Well, we're still in the lead, so that's a good thing. And of course, there has been an update since we last played as well, which um, fixed a few sound issues and some other bugs in the game as well. We're in the lead. And I think we got a pretty decent lead at the moment. We're on lap number two. So we've got one more lap to go after this. But at the moment, it's all going well. Crowd loving a good a good whip. A good scrub. Of course we're on our KTM now. If you remember in the last video we did switch to a KTM. We're all over the place. Oh, we slid straight off the side there. Just staying on. I don't know. Our lead didn't look that, that big. I just about saw the uh, second place guy. Been a bit all over the place on this lap, if I'm honest. Come to the end of the second lap. Didn't drift too wide that time. Okay, start the final lap now. I think it should be quite a clear run to the end now, to the finish. Third place man's crashed. Max Anstey there just crashed in third place, so he's going to be dropping down the order. So far so good, our first race back into Mo uh, MXGP3. And it's gone pretty well. Can't get any more than a win. I haven't changed any of the difficulty settings or anything. Still on the highest difficulty, still Pro Simulation and Pro Physics even. And of course uh, using manual gears still. Oh fuck! Okay, that was a mistake. Come on, get going. That was a pretty big mistake there. Slid off the edge and uh, respawned. We've still got a bit of a buffer behind us, so it's not too bad. Not what I wanted to do on the last lap. 
I think we would have actually been alright if it hadn't have, uh, respawned us. We would have just slid down the bank a little bit. But we didn't come off. Okay, right near the end now, just got this last corner to go now. Got a bit wide, but it's fine. There we go, first race back, first race in Italy, and we get the win. Let's take a sneaky uh, screenshot as well. Okay, well there we go. Only won by three seconds because we did fuck up on the last lap, but still had just a bit of a time buffer to second place. Benoit and uh, managed to take the win. So Max Anstey still got fourth place. There we go. It's all going well at the moment. Time to do race two now. Of course, staying on the KTM. Oh, it looks a lot brighter this time. A hell of a lot brighter. Let's try and do this. Come on. Oh, that was a shit start. That was appalling. We've almost gone straight to the back. Almost went down to last place, but not quite. We're already up to seventh place. They really need to uh, up the AI in this game. What? Ooh, their games actually. Seventh at the moment. Oh, lost a place down at eighth, up to sixth, up to fifth, maybe even higher by the next corner. He's gone wide. Took a tight line and we're up to four. No, we're not. He came back. He got a better run out. Oh, just hit the sign and uh, stopped ourselves going off track there. So fifth place at the moment. Not having it as easy as last time. Where oh no, definitely not. He's fighting back. Okay, up to fourth now. Surely we can stick there now. gone very wide. Still in fourth. Leader's not too far ahead, which is good. Right. Closing in on third place. Oh, really closing on him now. We seem to be a lot quicker through this section, so we're up to third now. So we're on the podium. Oh, he's gone very wide as we shove up the inside. Have we got second place? Just about. Yes, we got second. We've made a haul up to that, though. Drop back down to third. So we've got quite a bit of work to do still as we go up the inside to second place. We made it stick that time. So it's just the leader now. And we're on the second lap of three. The inside here. We're through into the lead. No, we're not. He's back through. Back down a second. The inside. We got the lead. I think we're going to stay there. Ooh. That was a real bad land in there from my my um, scrub trying to get past him there's a horrible landing that's why we lost lost the lead Didn't have any drive out okay Drifting a little bit wide but it's all good at the moment Oh, stay on track, stay on track. Oh, just staying on track there. I thought we were going to end up getting uh, respawned again, like we did in the first race, but we managed to stay on track just. So second race, back into the lead, and looking like we're going to take another victory. So one lap to go. So 
going well. Although last time I said that, I kind of jinxed myself and fucked up. So hopefully we won't do that this time. Let's try and stay on the track. Kind of got into a little rhythm now, which uh, is definitely helping us. I think we got about a three or four second lead, so... Dude, no, 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 fuck's sake, the same corner! We fucked up again, on the last lap as well! There's something about me in that corner. It's not happening. <laughs> Okay, he's really close now, a lot closer than the first time we fucked up. So, doing my best to throw it all away, but we've still got a bit of a lead. Oh shit! It's fine. Well, just the final corner to go, and unless I completely fuck that up, which we haven't, it's going to be the double at Italy. Can't believe I've done that again. The same corner, same exact corner. Just got my rear off the edge of the track, and uh, down we went. So we still won by about five seconds. There's the championship. We're pulling away. So far, so good. Okay, so the next race in Spain. Didn't qualify on pole. We didn't qualify that well at all, actually, but it doesn't matter. Let's... Oh, no, that's not what we want to do. Oh, fucking hell, what happened there? The camera went funny. To the first corner. We're up to 12. No, we're not. I don't know what where we are. Around the outs. No, fucking hell. I don't know what's happening. So we're 11th. It's a very moist Spain. It's not raining. Yes, it is raining. <laughs> it, it, yeah, it's just started raining. So it was just a, a wet track, but now it is raining. So that's what we've got to contend with the slipperiness of the mud. Try and move up to ninth place. Trying. Okay, we've got ninth. Come on. Right, seventh place is ours. Ooh, shit. I thought I out. Well, I knew I out broke myself for that corner. This hasn't been the easiest first lap. Sick. The leader's not too far ahead. Oh shit, sorry to. <laughs> I don't even know how he stayed on that. We're in fifth place. Come on. Inside up to fourth. End of the first lap, and we're in fourth place, trying to take third. Championship rival is in second place. Inside here. No, he's going to be on the inside with the left hand if we cut back underneath. Not happening at the moment. No, still fourth. Right, he's gone wide. That's that. No, 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 no. Oh, shit, 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 shit. <laughs> Again, we're, we're having troubles with the edge of the track at the moment. Luckily, it didn't actually respawn us, so we managed to stay in fourth place. But we lost quite a bit of time, so we've got. A lot of work to do again. And that's only to get into third place. The leader has broken away a little bit. As we uh, take corners a bit too tight. There's the leader just off in the distance. Just about make him out. Trying to take third place. There we go. Into third. 
Then we've got this horrible hairpin. He's trying to come up the inside. He hasn't achieved that, so we stay in third place. Can we catch the leader, though? We may run out of time. Let's see if we can get our championship rival, though, and at least get second. I don't know, he's caught the leader, and we're catching them both. So at the moment, it's looking all right. Still got a whole lap to go. So we ain't got a panic just yet. So that's the end of lap number two. And we go into second place. I may even take the lead. Not nope, we've lost second, but we got oh we've got the lead now. Both went a little bit wide and we took advantage of that. Despite Jeffrey shoving up the inside of us. Now, can we pull away? Will they try and retaliate? Oh, he's going to try and retaliate because we've got another shit X out of that corner. They're both right there. We haven't pulled away much at all. The hill. Down again. Right, I think we're getting there with our lead now. Pulling away, pulling the pin. That was better through there. Didn't have anyone trying to shove it up the inside and we managed to get it stopped in time as well. It's going well. I think we are pretty safe now. So we just got to run to the line to get the last few corners out of the way. There we go. There's the finish line and we're done. Another win for us. This time in Spain. In a very wet Spain. But we got it done. Definitely had to work for that one. I know we won by about four seconds in the end, but let's see if we can do the same in race number two. It's still raining. So let's go do this. Off we no, another jump in the gun a bit. Another shit start. We are dead last this time, although we've made up loads of positions already. Right around the outside of all of them. Most of them. We're up to 11th, 8th, 9th. Probably going to lose another place. 10th. So we're not making it easy on ourselves. We're not having a very good starts at all. And this corner seems to just dig in and not get very good traction out of it. Oh, hello. So still in 10th place. The inside here, we've got ninth. Start making a bit more progress now. The inside here, we're up to seventh. May even be able to get sick. Yes, we do. Oh, oh, hello. Okay, up to 4th place, wasn't actually expecting that, he has come back through to push us down to 5th. Oh, no, we may even lose another place. No, we hold him off at the inside. No, not quite working, so still 5th, but it's fine. Oh, well, <laughs> it's a massive thump there as I went past him. 4th. Where's the leader? The leader's got a bit of a break on. He's pushing and he is breaking away at the moment. So we go ahead of Jeffrey. Third place. Oh, almost took my rear out. This is, of course, lap number two. He's got a pretty decent lead at the moment. We need to try and get ahead of this guy and get in the second place. This is 
where we usually suffer. That was better out of there that time. Didn't spin up so much. We need to get him. We need to get ahead of him. He's holding us up a little bit. Right, through it. Here we go. Second place is ours. Now, can we close that lead down? No, he's coming back through. Forced us a bit wide. But we still managed to just hold him off. But we've got this hairpin. Is he going to shove up the inside here? We've gone a little bit wide, so I expect he will. Yes, he does. But he doesn't quite manage to make it stick. Catching the leader. Which is good. Oh, that was so close to a crash. Slide all over the place. But we are catching him. Try and get some speed through here. Seem to be able to carry a bit more corner speed through that corner. And it's time to start the final lap. Still in second. I'm not going to try it up the inside here. He's got a little bit wide, but not too much. Where can we get him? Oh, we went a bit too hot into there. Up the inside here, he's gone wide. But no, because we've got a crap exit as usual. He's pulling away again. We may have blown our chance for the win. Come on, let's keep pushing. Never say never. Never give up. Just making loads of mistakes on this last lap. It's just letting him get away. Into the hairpin. Oh, we closed in there. He's gone wide. We're into the lead, but we're going to hold it. Gone a bit wide there. He's not coming through. We're staying in the lead. I think we got this. I think we've got this. We're usually a bit quicker through here anyway. And then it's just the final corner. Done! Well, we left it a bit late to take the lead that time, but we got it. Took the win. The double again, this time in Spain. Okay. Really helping our championship. Next race now in France. This will be the last two um, races of the video. Let's go do this. Again, not a great qualifying position, but we're going to give it a go. Well, that was a horrific start there. I actually thought I pressed the uh, the gear up button. In fact, I'm pretty sure I pressed it, but uh, nothing happened. So we stayed in neutral for a little bit. But we've already got up to 11. Made up half the field already, despite that dreadful start. Through them two, and we're up to eighth, maybe even seventh. Yes, it is. No, yes, it is. Seventh place. Still on the KTM, just changed my riding gear to match it better. Which is what I was meant to do when I first got on the KTM, but didn't. So, fifth place. Still on the first lap. May even take fourth. Yes, we do. So, fourth place. This corner is horrible. I've crashed there many times in qualifying.
Right, then it gets nice and narrow and tight. Oh, <laughs> you looked a bit funny there, Jeffrey did. But we're up to third. Okay, so third place at the moment. Not even done with the first lap yet. We're at the end of the lap, but we're not quite done with it yet, and we're still in third. And we're up to second. We may even take the lead before the end of the first lap. I don't think we will, though. The inside here. It's going to be tight, but no. Oh, yeah, we're into the lead now. And we've lost it again. We had the inside line. Oh, <laughs> a bit of handlebar bashing in the air there. Can we get back past him? We've got a good run there and we're back into the lead. Through the hairpin. So this next corner, completely blind and if you go in there too quick, you do end up just going straight to the, uh, the cameraman. Now we're going to push. I actually quite like this track. I know it gets a bit technical around this part, but it's quite a nice track, especially when you nail the corners. In the lead. So now, can they fight back? But I can't even hear them now, so I think we've pulled away quite dramatically already. A bit wide there. Final corner as we start finish. So final lap, we're in the lead, and we're just going to be pulling away now. Oh, that was a big mistake doing that there. Not the best jump to do a scrub at. Crowd are loving it. I'm loving it. Wow. It always feels better when you take a win. <laughs> Big jump. And then the track narrows. Really narrows round here. But we've got such a big lead now, I wouldn't even like to guess what our lead is. I'm going to say at least six seconds. Fourth place has just crashed. But yeah, that's what I'm going to go for, about six seconds by the time we finish this race. Oh, a bit away over the place there. Just hit a rut at the wrong time. Penultimate corner. And then final corner coming up, and it's going to be our first win in France. There we go. So, I did say I reckon I won by six seconds. What did we win by? One by seven. Let's see if we can do it again for race number two. So seven seconds we won the first race by. See if we can do it again. Better start this time. We didn't stay in neutral for about two seconds that time. Already right at the front. Facts. No, not in fact, actually. Yeah, we've taken the lead. So just a few corners and we've already taken the lead. Surely this one is just going to be a race to the finish. I don't think we're going to get bothered by the AI anymore. I think we're pretty safe from them already. They're not going to be a problem for 
the rest of this race. So last time we won by 7 seconds, but it took us a little while to get into the lead because of that horrendous start. So, what shall we go for? I would say 10, but I'm going to be a bit more ambitious. Let's go for 12 second lead. That's what I'm going to go for, so let's push all the way and see if we can get a win by at least 12 seconds. Of course, if I do fuck up, then uh, that will be game over straight away. Ooh! We fucked up there, but not too bad. So go gunning for the 12. Don't even know why I said 12, actually. Surely I should have said 13, because that's the number I'm using. Yeah, let's fuck it. Let's go for 13 seconds. Thirteen seconds is the time I want to beat the AI by. It would be really nice to have some split times come up to actually tell you how far behind they are. Because you haven't got a mini-map, so you can't see on a mini-map mini how close they are or how far behind they are. So, yeah, just some nice split times would be good. Especially on qualifying as well. It would be nice to know, like, if you're up in a certain sector or not. But... It is what it is. We're only on lap two. Okay. Uh, <laughs> I thought we were like just starting the final lap there. Okay, so no, we're only on lap two. Won't be long till we start the final lap. Right, last time we almost fucked up through here because we went way too wide. But it's fine that time. So the big question is, will the next MotoGP game, I know it's like really early, just start talking about the next MotoGP game. But will we finally get a MotoGP game with the Unreal 4 engine powering MotoGP? That would be ideal. We'll have to wait and see. Of course, MotoGP 17 hasn't even been out that long, so let's stop talking about MotoGP 18 now. Let's just concentrate on MXGP 3. We're definitely on the final lap now, which uh, is good. So this has been a very lonely race. A very, very lonely race. So 13 seconds is what I said. Well, originally I said 12, but we're going to go for our racing number and go for number 13. I reckon we've done it by even more than that. I reckon we've done at least 15, but I'm going to stick with 13. Because there's still time for me to absolutely fuck up and chuck it all away. Ooh. Veered off into the barrier. I think my guy just hit his head. 13 seconds. Pretty confident we've actually done it. Anything less than that, and we're gonna have to gonna have to push loads. The final race. There we go. Did we win by 13 seconds? That was the goal. Give me the times. Ah. Just missed out 12 seconds in the end, so not quite 13, 
But anyway, guys, that is it from me. Thank you so much for watching. Don't forget to leave this video a like if you enjoyed it. Subscribe to my channel for more content. And I shall see you guys in the next video. See you.